Hi, welcome back to Lesta Student YouTube channel. So today I'm going to show you. I'm going to explore one of the building at the University of Leicester. It is called Bennett Building. So I have friends here. I think he's waiting over there. So yeah, let's explore together about the Bennett Building. So um, can you show us uh, maybe about the Bennett Building? What is inside of the Bennett Building? Yeah. Is there any um, interesting thing here? It's a very modest building, to be honest. A lot of stuff is to do with... Oh wait, I don't even need this, I think. Oh, this is the lecture theater this one. Lecture okay, let's theater. see inside. Ooh. Oh my god. This is so cool. So, in our course, there are about 70 people, maybe? 70 people? In a master's course. Yeah. Master course. So, yeah. <laughs> So, so basically, you if you have like class practice. here, um, the attendance will be 70 and the lecturer will stand there. Whenever I want to attend. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Wow, this is so cool. Yeah. Like cinema, you know? Yeah, pretty much. Um, you would have actually two projectors. There are even three, I think, right? Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Um, attendance is, I guess, mandatory, but uh, even if it you are not attending you can access the material usually supported so i mean this is usually how the oh my god there. we have, have, have dinosaurs <laughs> oh this is t-rex maybe is it real it's just a sound but what is it the art construction or something like that i don't know oh you have dinosaurs yeah i think the geologist would know not, not me though <laughs> And then we have dinosaur eggs. <laughs> dinosaur eggs? <laughs> oh, oh my god, maybe we can use this for uh, making a film, yeah? Jurassic Park. This is another lecture room, number 10. Oh. So this yeah. is a smaller one. The smaller one, yeah? yeah. But it's, it's quite nice. And how about this one? The picture. I think this one is for geology, the one for geography with the upstairs. Yeah. Yeah. Geology. Those one for the geology, yeah. Oh, okay. And this is the uh, department's head. The department's head, 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 head of the geography. The head of school. The head of school. <laughs> the head of school. This is the head of school. This is another seminar room. This is the smaller one. one. Uh, like meetings, actually. So. Meeting uh, room. Yeah, it's with when we're with our supervisor to like talk about our dissertation. It's some like in own similar to these, but we usually use this one. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Unfortunately, that is closed. I hear good things about that case. But Don't worry. Closed. Maybe so, next time. Yeah. And I'm not really one to talk about it because it's also geology. <laughs> so for geography, um, do you have any maybe specific place that yeah, maybe you always get closed, around? So. <laughs> it's closed, unfortunately, but I can show you where it is. So ground floor is mainly has the geology posters and geology uh, stuff, and then. The second floor is the place where we have the geography stuff and the geography materials. Okay. So let's go for the second floor. Second floor. This is now related to geography. This is... Oh, this is geography. So yeah, this so is Lister actually. Yeah. And this is the University of Lister. Oh, which one? Here. This is our campus here? Yeah? This University is our campus University. and we are basically in that building. This is the Bennett building. Mm. Um, this is Victoria Bar. Okay. So this is a DSM, what they call it. Digital surface model. So you DSM? Can, yeah. Digital? Surface model. Surface model, okay. Yeah. So you can see like uh, the, the trees, you know. You can notice them from there. This is in uh, Victoria Bar mm -hmm. in this area. Um, it's usually our product represents elevations, so high high areas and low areas and that. Uh, this is the computer one. 
Yeah. The computer room. Do you use this room as well? We use this for a while. We're gonna look at when when you are doing GIS. GIS. Yeah, geographical information systems or geographical information science. So what is this? Let's see. I actually don't know. This is the first time I see this. I'm assuming this has to do more with remote sensing, though I'm not sure. I think this is maybe something like um, publication. Yeah. What is this? Oh, right. Yeah, a virtual reality. Can we can we in enter the room? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't have the code. Yeah. Okay. Honestly, we only entered this room once and we only tried the virtual reality once. So what is inside? I mean, it's like the feet up, like the, the post, I like mean, the <laughs> sciences, virtual reality meaning. Like hologram, something like that? VR. VR. Yeah. And that's now there is big research on trying to incorporate that with rotation. So you are kind of, you know, uh, you've been in OpenStreetMap before, right? It's like you, you used OpenStreetMap. Uh, no, not OpenStreetMap. I'm um, sorry. Google, uh, uh, Google, Google Maps. Google Maps. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? So when you are using Google Maps, you can drop down in the street. And yeah. Check. How, how it looks. That's kind of similar, but with VR goggles. VR, oh. And you can even control, uh, like you have controls, and you can move around. So what is this? This is uh, what they call time series analysis. So Time series, you do time series analysis. Yeah, so uh, this is to do with NDVI, uh, no, MDWI, sorry. So normalized difference water index, what they call it. But yeah, we have a big assignment to do about like you kind of pick your topic, and I, mine is time series. So yeah, that's kind of what I'm doing at the moment. This is what the thing should look like, but I'm not sure. I'm still like still haven't finished it yet. Why do you choose geography, and why University of Leicester? Well, for the geography part. Yeah. Um, it's kind of always been a thing with me. I, I like to balance my work, working outside and working inside, and that uh, like geographic disciplines anyway offer that usually. You kind of do a bit of both. You do field work and you do um, like a bit of software work or programming sometimes, um, like just to relate it work as well um, but yeah this is mostly like because of the balance between the two, the two that's usually <laughs> that's really why i picked it mm -hmm. and why university of leicester do you like university of leicester i mean university of leicester is good mm -hmm. <laughs> for me anyway um did i really pick it that's really I, i'm here on scholarship so mm -hmm. that's kind of decided for me but Mm -hmm. It's it's a good university in terms of what I'm learning. Mm -hmm. um, there is things that could be improved. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna be uh, like uh, I'm not gonna be biased, you know. Mm -hmm. There are some things that could be improved, sure, but in general, it's a good enough university. Mm, good enough university. Yeah. Do you have good experience? No, about university, about studying. Do you feel comfortable with the facilities here? I, uh, I'm, t I tell you, I'm telling you, I am really enjoying my time here at the University of Leicester. And I am really sad that we are by the end of our year for the master. So that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching the video. And thank you so much for my friends for showing us um, what the Bennett building looks like. And then to show us um, the facilities. Yeah, and I'll see you at the next video. Bye-bye. Yeah.